the WNBA MVP champion. The laundry list continues. Brianna Stewart, you and I did the boardroom last year where you were the first WNBA player revealed with their rating. Do you remember what that rating was? I was trying to remember. Um, I think it was a 95, 95, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I was thinking it was 95. All right, so what do you think about your rating this year? What do you, where do you think it's going to net out? Um, I don't know, because I'm like, maybe it went down a little because I, I'm coming back from an Achilles rupture. Maybe it went up a little because I had a good season. Maybe it's the exact same. You are exactly a 95 again. And I think it's a lot to do with what you just said, which is uh, the injury. Uh, you had just come off the championship right when we gave you that rating before. Um, but then you had such an amazing comeback and cr- congratulations on all that. But um, yeah, you're exactly the same rating. How, do, how are you feeling about that? To be honest, I feel great about that. I think that um, when I was looking at KD's rating and I was I knew we were going to do this, I was like, I think his dipped a little bit because he still hasn't came back. Yeah, after the injury. Uh, it's good. So then yeah. I was like, well, mine's going to go down, but hopefully it goes up. So that's that's where the 90 I mean, your return was amazing, though. You, you killed it. So... I, I could see it. Uh, so look, now we're looking ahead, obviously off that injury, you really get better a year later, right? So where do you think it's going to net out after next year? Um, I need to keep going up. So hopefully I'm like 96, 97, um, trying to stay consistent like like LeBron's. Um, I thought that he was, I think, what, 98 in 2007 and 98 now in 2020. So hopefully mine's like... I love that. Keep that energy. Hey, good luck in Russia. Uh, I know you're playing overseas there. And then good luck uh, training and getting ready for the upcoming WNBA season. Thank you.